Hey, this is Drew Baird from Moon Audio and welcome back to Audiophile Tech Tips. Sometimes it's the simplest things that we forget about or we don't really realize are important. So what we're gonna talk about today is muting your headphone amp or turning off a song in your digital audio player before you disconnect your headphones. And why is this important? And it does, it does come down to which connectors you use. But look at the quarter inch. So the quarter inch has three poles, one, two, three. And if you can see the two black tabs that separate the poles, this is where obviously we're brick walling, if you will, the electrical circuit from each individual tab here. Now, when you plug this into a headphone amp and you slowly push it through, what's happening is internally there are these three tabs for the quarter inch, right? That as you push this pull through, they're crossing over. Well, what happens sometimes? The tabs are bigger than the black rings on your connector. If you can see some black rings here, right? So that tab is gonna momentarily go over two of the poles of that connector. And what happens is we're having two electrical signals hit each other at once, either a right and a left channel or a ground and a left channel or, or so forth, right? So it's always important, and this is part of the reason that we put a mute circuit on this amplifier so that when you disconnect your quarter inch, you've got it muted and there's no electrical current. Now, in situations like an acetylene current here, where we've got five poles, let me tell you, there's a lot more chance for overlap here with all five poles here. There's five tabs inside that are wanting to sticky onto this male connector. So it's even more important in this situation. Make sure you pause your player, turn the volume down before you unjack your headphones. This isn't good for your internal amplifier. It doesn't like to see this crosstalk between channels and grounds and so forth. You're basically gonna shunt a channel to ground or something like that, and it's just not good for your device. So this is just a real simple thing, but it's a very important thing. Now, in situations with a four pin XLR where we've got all of these pins separated, when you pull, push it in or pull it out, there's only one single tab in each situation on the four pins that is contacting and we don't have this issue. I would still suggest, even when unjacking your balanced headphones, just to be safe because you are you know, there's, there's an electrical current going on. You have a, a, a sharp break in that current. You know, I don't think it's gonna cause a problem, but with, especially with tubes, you know, you can have a rush of current or whatnot in the tube and maybe get, you know, some kind of uh, noise issue or whatnot. It's always a great idea. Put it in mute, pause your music, then unjack your headphones. So, like I said, sometimes it's the simplest things that we don't think about. I got an email last week and it said, you know what, maybe I should let people know about this because I guarantee you most people don't even think about it. So hopefully this is helpful. Make sure you leave some questions below. Make sure you subscribe and we'll see you next week.